Okay, thing number one to practice for this week. Everything is going great. I think you're moving along at a good rate, and we're going to keep going. Uh, D and A7, just moving that back and forth, super easy. Here's your D. Here's your A7. It's not a huge thing, but if you find the guitar starting to slip down into your lap like this, try to keep it more or less straight up and down. D, A7. That's good. Everything's cool. The next thing we're going to do is D, G, A7, and then D. Notice I'm picking down here. Sometimes people ask me about that. It just, it just sounds a little different. It doesn't really matter where exactly you pick. It starts on a D, G, A7, back to D. The third thing, we're going to switch gears here for a second, and this is the finger exercise. It's just our first three fingers here, one, two, and three. And we could put those on any fret here on the guitar, and then we're just going to put them down right in order on the same string. One, two, three. Down towards the floor. One, two, three. Down towards the floor. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Try to, when you get to three, try to have them all touching the string and not lift it up. So get all three of them glued down there. Not one, two, three, and where they, the other one is lift up. Now, you don't have to do it. We tried it at the seventh fret. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You don't have to do it there. You could start way up here on the skinny frets. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. Or all the way down here on some of the wider frets, but that's going to help you stretch your fingers out. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. One, two, three. Last but not least, we have a song, and the song is three times for each one of those chords. It's three times on D. One, two, three. Three times on A7. Three more times on A7. Back to three times on D. Second line starts on D. Now three times on G, one finger. Three times on A7. And back to three times on D. And that's it. And if you find yourself kind of taking a second to switch, one, two, three. One, something like that. Then go back to steps one and two, where you just practice moving your fingers back and forth between the D and A7. D, G, A7, D. Cool. Have some fun with that. Everything's going great. We'll see you next time, and good luck.